So let's go end the level. Can I make it? No. I'm gonna have to go around the top of this again. If I had double jump, I could just double jump across it. But no, I don't get that luxury. Actually, we might get that the next level. If the next level is the level I'm thinking of. In fact, you know, I, I haven't gone up here yet. Oh, wait, you can't go up here. That's right. I think I tried doing it with double jump. I don't think you can get up there at all. Questioning your faith? We all have oh, I'm always questioning my faith, UAC spokesperson, man. All right, who's ready to smash it? Stopping our energy production is what you want, then you need only to destroy this last filter, and Argent Energy will no longer exist in this solar system. We will be back at square one. And square one it shall be. How beautiful. Goodbye, energy. You have no idea what you have just done. Olivia is still alive. I've detected her life signature at the Argent Tower. She has removed one of the accumulators from the tower base. It has a unique energy signature that we can track. Well, that's it then. There's nothing else to be done. I don't know why that thing wasn't moving. But let me tell you, we destroyed Argent Energy. We we killed a lot of demons. I messed up a lot. Almost panicked so hard I died in real life. But now we gotta go to the toxin refinery. How fun! Now the toxin refinery. I uh, if you recall back to the first classic map I did, I believe I talk about how much I dislike doing this in this game because the. The enemies here just like to spam big area moves in thin corridors, like that guy, like he tried to do. So that's why he gets blown up first. Now, let me just try not to kill myself with explosive barrels. Like, seriously, look at that. He shoots it so close, and like, you can't do anything about it. See, that, that's exactly what I mean. Now that, now that that's done, it doesn't get too awful from here. Unless I, you know, kill myself. Ugh. Wow. You've been stunned, you get off a few shots and you get stunned again. I'm gonna try not to stand too close to the nooks. I think it does damage you from there. And as always, you can't see any of the enemies down there because they spawn once you get down there. And if you're having fun, you can just peep open the window and shoot that and kill almost everything. Now, it should be important to note that you actually don't get the secret exit here. Um, so basically doing that is just a waste of time, so we're gonna do it anyways, just to show that it's there. Because even though you don't get counted for secrets here, I for some reason just... I, I have a hard-on for secrets. Well, I never pushed the switch to open up the side room. That explains so much. But I'm gonna do everything, you know, normally until we get the, the blue key card. Like, you know, I'm pretty much gonna show off the secret when I get back over there, so that way we're not making two redundant trips. Uh, I'll just shoot you. Oh yeah, and there's a pinky. Uh, spoilers. Look, bro, you need to stop shooting your damn pea shooter. Now, I won't get too much into how the pinkies are until we actually run into them, but just know that you should shoot for the light pink areas. Oh, yeah. yeah let, me, let me just take that glory kill and get that health. Now, I mentioned also... Well, I guess it was the second classic stage. She's how we got entryway first, but I talk about how getting secrets is a bit harder in this game when it, when it comes to the timing. So basically, now that we've hit this, we need to turn around, run forward, you know, no boosting on walls, none of that fun stuff. As I say, is this going to open up? And I also believe that both of those 
or both the doors are on like the same trigger, which I don't think that's how it is in regular Doom. Just climb that. Get our supercharge. Yeah, as you see that this stuff's still down, so we need to go down here in order to open it again. Which usually I'm pretty sure the trigger is coming out of that room. I don't know if I can, I can't confirm or deny this myself because I haven't played regular Doom in a while. Wow, you just pegged your friend. What a dick. No, let's not shoot that right now. And you know, you can still go this way. Still hit the switch to get the bridge. But there's just no actual exit. Uh, do I need this? No, because I don't have a chain gun. But thankfully I got this rocket launcher for Monster Claws that's coming up. You can also make a metronome with the, the mod button. It's pretty nice. I like to do that a lot when I'm just playing like these maps on my own. Let's just make some random assorted percussion beats. Don't even think about it, bud. See ya. Now, I don't know why this guy deserves a rocket launcher, but he does. And then you saw the imp up there. I'm gonna deal with him in a minute. Oh boy. That's a lot of explosions that just happened. My entire armor's gone. Thanks, bud. Right, let's go kill this imp. Wow, he exploded. And his body fell down. You can't actually do that in, uh... You, in this version, you can't actually go off that little secret ledge. You know, it's 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 baby mode. How's it going, fellas? I was guarding the blue key for eternity. I want to see how that's going for you. And then that. Sadly, no lights get shut off. It doesn't become super spooky. Which is a shame. I mean, hell, even in the Doom 3 mod for this, that happens. I can't believe it is so soulless now. <laughs> Never mind that. So now that we've, you know, gotten the blue key, we can go ahead and take out this pathway. Grab your rocket launcher for all these pesky dudes that are going to be showing up. Especially because there's a pinky. I guess also the imps. I'd much rather just have to deal with playing with a bowl than having to deal with a bunch of heckling fans throwing tomatoes. And once he hits the wall or gets near it, then you just go for it. And like I said, no exit switch. But you can go over here. There's nothing up here, but... I just want to show it off, and as you can see, I can't go forward. So now let's just finish the stage proper. See how I'm just increasing the length of these videos artificially at this rate. Like I could go over 10 minutes, bro, or else YouTube's not going to pay me money. Huh. Is that still a funny joke to make? Alright. Uh, you know, I it's been so long since I've actually been over here. Because I never take this route, so I always try to play every level in Doom. Oh boy, I think I have at least one rocket left. I guess I do have a chainsaw. These give you like one use. Yeah, give me ammo. This is you're about to fire. Oh, there's still more of you here. Let's just take care of that issue. And especially with you up there. If you were at home, that's what you do. No, there, there can't be more secrets over here. There is. Whoa. Huh. I've, like, <laughs> rarely seen the secret. What the hell kind of yell was that? Wow. There's been a lot more to the stage that I don't remember than I originally thought. Like, what was that, that screaming then? Oh, yeah, you get a nice little 3D auto map. What does this one do? 
Oh, that's just how I got in here. Hey, do you hear that though? The, the screeching. Oh, maybe it's just him being very upset that I killed all his friends. Don't worry, bud. You get the special treatment. Alright, and that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. And next time we're going to meet a very angry bonehead, as it were. So until then, you guys have a good day. And I'll see you guys next time.